Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to day 574 of trying a new makeup product every day. So you might be wondering why I'm already wearing my blue lipstick, but that's because I'm trying out a different type of product than I've tried so far on this series because this is almost like an opposite of makeup product. It's the Kiss and Buy Lip Color Remover. So I got this from Shop Miss A. This was part of my recent Shop Miss A haul. So if you haven't seen that video, I will have that linked down below. But this just seems really intriguing to me. It's from the brand JK Just Color, which I believe is a Santee, Santee brand because it says SanteeCosmetics.com on the back of it. I didn't realize those two brands were related in some way, but that's kind of cool. And because this is from Shop Miss A, it's cruelty free and only cost $1. <laughs> but so the lipstick that I'm wearing right now is my Jeffree Star Cosmetics Huntington Beach liquid lipstick. And if you want to see my whole review video on this lipstick, I will have that video linked down below as well. But I just thought this would be such a fun lipstick to try this product out with. I will admit that this is not an impossible lipstick to get off, but it is pretty difficult. And if product like this, especially a $1 product, can make it easier, then I love that. And so this is also why, to me, $1 makeup is so fun, because I never would even think to buy a product like this, a lip color remover. And I probably wouldn't spend any more than like a dollar on it anyways, because I can just use soaps and face washes and makeup removers to get this lipstick off anyways. But it's just really fun to try out different types of products, especially innovative products. So let's see here. It's a doe foot applicator. I don't get any scent from this at all. Which is fine. So it says to apply it to your lips and then rub it away. And I actually, fun fact, I have not used cotton balls in, I would say like almost two years. Two years ago, I bought these from Amazon. They're just like reusable fabric rounds but these are the same ones I bought almost two years ago that I'm still using. They're in great condition. They haven't frayed at all or come apart. And I think I got like a pack of 12 and I have like some white ones, some pink ones and some blue ones, but they're really soft, great quality. I probably spent around $20 on them, but I feel like I'm doing something better for the environment when I use these instead of cotton balls. But so that's what I'm going to be using to rub away the lip color remover. So let's see how this goes. Oh my gosh. This actually is working so easily, just rubbing the doe foot applicator across my lips already starts removing the lip color and then just one swipe look at how much just came off in one swipe the thing is though now you have the color all over the doe foot here and it just got into the oil I feel like I need to clean the applicator. So I'm just taking a makeup wipe and I'm gonna try and clean this off because I feel like I'm just adding the color back onto my lips when I use it again. Oh my gosh, <laughs> it's almost all completely gone. I wish I had cleaned off the applicator before putting the blue back into the tube here because now I'm like picking up more blue color when I use the oil. 
I'm calling it oil because that really is like the texture that it has. It just feels like a thin oil. But it really is working great. That really worked. The lip color is completely gone and in such an easier, quicker way than when I have to scrub at it. So this was painless, easy. So this really worked. But the thing is, I'm sure that this works just as well as any other kind of oil cleanser, but I just like the fact that it has the doe foot applicator and it makes it so easy to just apply right to the lips. And it's only a dollar and it worked great. So I'm happy about this and I'm glad to have this in my collection now. So if you have a hard time removing liquid lipsticks, I would definitely recommend getting this. But if you don't have this product, I would love to know in the comments down below your tips on how you remove those stubborn makeup products. Do you love to use an oil? Do you have a certain cleanser that you really like, a certain makeup remover? Let me know in the comments down below your tips. And thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.